Hey everyone, I just recently went and bought a new book, Magical Mystery by Sven Regner, which is a German author I really like. And since you're always asking me about German authors and I hardly ever read any, I thought today I'll film a video about two German authors that I really like. So Sven Regner is the first one. I don't have all of his books, but I really like his style of writing. So he wrote Herr Lehmann, which is his first book, and that's also translated into English and I think it's the only one that you can get. So in English it would be Berlin Blues. It's the story of this Herrlimann who is in Berlin and in the end of the 80s and things that happened to him. And The special thing about Sven Regner, which I really really like, is his style of writing. The way he just talks. There's narration and a lot of dialogue and it's just very Northern German and I don't know how else to describe it, but the way his characters talk and the way his story is narrated, it's just, yeah, it just feels like home. And so I really like that about his writing. So the second book he wrote is Neue Fahr Süd, which is about the same character, Hellimann, but before he moved to Berlin. So it's the time he spent in the German army and how he tried to get out of that and his life in Bremen back then. And then he wrote Der Kleine Bruder, which is basically a story in Berlin again, which is after Neue Fasu technically, because it's about Herr Lehmann's bigger brother, who's already in Berlin, and the little brother is Herr Lehmann, and at the end of the book he comes to Berlin. So this connects the trilogy of all the books about Herr Lehmann. Then he wrote something which is not available and that I haven't read, it's Angulus Durus or something, and I have no idea what that is, but I cannot get it because it's out of print for some reason or not available. I already talked about Meine Jahre mit Hamburg Heine on this channel, Channel, which is a collection of all the blogs he wrote in the last years, which are always coming back to this fictional character of Hamburg Heine. It's, it's nice, but not a must read. His newest book, Magical Mystery, just came out in September and I only started the book, but it's about a character that we know from Herr Lehmann, the first book he wrote, and in that book he ends up in a psychiatric ward because he has a nervous breakdown. So this is five years later when he stopped taking his pills and he's in Hamburg and not in Berlin anymore. So far I really like it, but I've only read 60 pages. So when it comes to German authors, I think Sven Regner is a really good contemporary author. He has a good feel for what's going on in a special part of society and he has a very good style of writing. So I can recommend him to anyone. The next author I want to talk about is Uwe Tim. He's a lot older and he has written way more books because he started earlier and a lot of his books are translated into various languages. I'll show you the books I have of Uwe Tim. The first book I read was Rot. It's about a man who writes eulogies for other people. And I really liked the style of writing and the story and I was just captured and flew through this book. In Kofjega he talks about like bank people who always sell things to their customers and how the customers deal with that and how everybody just wants to get more money and I think someone fled the country to evade taxes if I remember correctly. Am Beispiel meines Bruders is a story about his older brother who voluntarily joined the SS army and how he the family had to deal with and things that happened. Nicht morgen, nicht gestern is a collection of short stories. Die Entdeckung der Currywurst is not really about the discovery of the currywurst, but more a love story between a soldier and a woman in Hamburg in 1945. There are many more books by Uwe Tim. He wrote children books, he wrote adult books, he wrote books about society, about the war, and various topics and I think his writing style is really easy to read. You can just flow through it. You always feel very comfortable reading the book. It's not difficult, it's not too easy, it's not boring. It's just smooth and I really like to read his novels and I definitely need to read more of his work. So those are two German authors I really like. They are both still alive and writing and I really like their writing style and the stories they write are also interesting and thought-provoking and yeah. 